hello everyone so we are going to discuss today one special type of question uh, which i feel that that's called expression based okay expression based and that uh, uh, are around 20 percent in every physics paper right so we are going to discuss a very unique and very good trick which help us to understand uh, those type of question uh, doing really fast and it saves our time with accuracy right so this is around 20 percent of the physics question in any paper can be done with this technique and that's very really helpful and uh, the main thing is saves your time and gives you almost 100 percent uh, correct answer okay so uh, we are going to discuss that and then uh, i'll tell you like how we can do with that so for a sample i have taken this question okay once again yeah so i have taken this question which is uh, like uh, uh, like right now a very trending question everywhere you'll find this question this is the question asked in uh, our 2020 exam right so either you are preparing for NEET, CT, IT mains, uh, Comet K or uh, uh, BITS or any other exam uh, maybe KVPY and all so that might help you in objective type approach okay so what we do in this type of question we do manipulate the data so for manipulation of data your uh, IQ should be a bit better so it doesn't mean like uh, uh, without knowing so much of uh, in-depth concept you can just uh, solve this this is just a solving practice obviously you need to know the concept that's uh, uh, nothing can replace that but eventually if you want to solve it in competitive exam you need to be go uh, like be ahead of other people so i'm going to tell you a, uh, one concept here right so here what we can see uh, the question is uh, as you can see this is they are saying the maximum value of theta such that football does not start rolling so they are saying what maximum value of theta it can have max value okay for that obviously uh, uh, they are saying what is the maximum value of theta so for that i am considering that my this 2r distance this 2r distance is equal to the diameter of the football so in that case what will happen that uh, my football will fit in exactly like this okay like this okay it will fit in like this theta uh, sorry so once again i'll make this right so that theta so it will fit exactly in half exactly half like this so you can see simply so what maximum theta we can make is 90 degree right like this because my ball will be half here and half outside simple right because this is r that is also r so my maximum value if i am considering this condition r equals to r my theta should be 90 degree so i'll check which one is giving me 90 degree option number one sine theta equals to r by r which is one and theta is giving 90 degree correct this is no this is no this is this is theta is giving 45 degree correct that is eventually not an answer so just see just by 10 seconds or maximum 15 seconds we can get answer so this is an expression based question that is not related to our only uh, uh, kinematics or uh, you can say laws of motion or rotation or electrostats or modern physics it's a general approach right so kind uh, whenever we have a question uh, based on expressions which is 20 percent of the whole paper approximately we can solve those questions very easily so just uh, and try to use those concepts whenever the question you feel is tough not the easy one easy one so you can actually uh, solve it very easily so i'll come up with so many other tricks and so many other concepts which will help you to solve crack any exam uh, till then bye bye